All right, ladies and gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, welcome back to Mass Effect One Legendary Edition. We're we're in the the uh, what is it called? The Widow System? Yeah, the Widow System. And we need to just drop a couple of things off at the uh, Citadel, and then we're gonna head to Earth's Moon. Off we go. Let's see. I know I need to. Yeah, he's in the Citadel Tower. Was there not another thing? Keep scanning the keepers. Check in with Conrad Ver Werner, maybe. We just head down to towards the markets. Equalizing oh no. interior oh pressure with exterior atmosphere. Logged. The commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has the deck. All right. There we go. After years of poor economic performance, Exogeny has announced that its research colony on Pharos is finally returning a profit. New discoveries and a dedicated colonization effort have finally paid off for Exogeny. Wait, Exogeny's stock rose sharply with the announcement, with investors pleased at this surprising news. They're back up and running already? Hey. I mean, hey, that's a quick recovery. And I, I'm cool with that. Let's head to the markets. There he is. Hey, Commander Shepard, it's... There are rumors on the extranet that you've been made the first human specter. That's incredible. Being a Spectre is a big responsibility. I just want to make humanity proud. The vids are all talking about Commander Shepard fighting for all of us back home. And they also say that you don't take crap from anybody. You're showing them what humans can do. Hey, can I get your picture? Uh, sure. I don't have a problem with it, but why? You're a hero, Shepard. Decades from now, humanity's going to remember you. And I'll have your picture. Oh, you have no idea. Just hold up your gun. Perfect. <laughs> Thanks again, Commander. I'm gonna hang this in my living room. My wife will love it. That's, that's, that's weird. That's really weird. <laughs> D does your wife know you have an obsession with me? Is she also obsessed with Shepard? What's going on here? All right, I'm looking for Groth. Okay. Hello, sir. I'm on a break. Talk to someone else if you need anything. I've got a lot. I found your brother's body. His ship was attacked by privateers. Willem's dead? I guess I should have expected this. When his ship dropped out of contact, I just knew. But I kept hoping he might still be alive. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry for your loss. Thank you for finding him. It's better to know one way or the other. That's what they say, right? Yeah, definitely. Please excuse me. I need to go make arrangements for his funeral. Because when you just don't know, in the back of your head, no matter how unlikely it is, you just have the hope that they're coming home one day. Alright, I think... 
that's uh, it. Except for scanning the creep keepers, which I'd have to run around and try to find all, all that. So we're gonna go uh, back to the Normandy. Uh, come on, there we go. And shit, where is it? Tise. All right, this is to the docking bay. Lovely. Awesome. Alliance officials have raided a dangerous cult controlled by a former Alliance officer, Major Kyle. Major Kyle surrendered and is now being treated for severe post-traumatic stress disorder. Yeah, he better be. I don't, need, I don't think PTSD cuts it. There, he's got to be more damaged than just that. PTSD doesn't make you start a cult. Stand by, shore party. Decontamination in progress. Logged. The commanding officer is aboard. Exo Presley stands relieved. Awesome. All right, boys, let's get out of here. We're going to head to the soul system now. So, you know, you just kind of want to be all well-rounded. doesn't turn on or off but look at that look at her it's us it's us love it hey look and it's oh god it's flipped the correct way I heard it was reversed at one point like it was going counterclockwise You know what would really be funny if the, de if the devs like put a bunch of like a ton of alien artifacts all over the moon? <laughs> See if I can climb up this mountain. Okay, definitely not as hard as some of the other planets. And it's a plateau. 
Oh boy, that's a that's a lot of defenses. both of these. Because I don't know which building there's three that I need to go into. Do they all connect? Okay. There might have been more of a cutscene. There are enemies here. Did something. There we go. All clear. I wonder what do it destroying these power junctions do? Do they just do they shut down the turrets or just send out shock waves? Open the door. I could have swore I heard that beep already. Data access point. Oh shit, what? Oh no! All targets. There we go. Perimeter secure. Cut, at least we're cutting off power from this rogue VI. and die the first uh, of the three computing uh, clusters for the VIs offline. Cool. So I need to go in all three Negative of the bases. Contact. All patched up. I just love the, the straight squat. He crab walks every time. <laughs> All the time.
earlier in this room. I don't know what taking out the conduits did, but we'll see. having a happy little time doing a dance. Same setup it back here. Although it kind of feels like they copy and pasted the bases. Scared the attack. fuck out of me, oh my god. I wonder if using the shotgun would be faster. Well, it's faster for that. Good. Area secure. Now for round three, and I'm not sure what we'll face, but good as new. Well, I'm not even sure if that's the end of it, because you know, we've played the game before, but we're at least close to getting this objective done. I think we're going to this one next. I wonder how Hostile these bunkers... spotted. Oh. Okay. How do these bunkers open? Clear. Oh, those those are the, uh, look at this, look at this, they're just all trying to swarm me. Garrus, I guess me. Because they just all swarmed the fucking That's door. It. Bag them and tag them. That's insane. And then I open it and they don't start immediately.
Additional security drones powering up. Oh my god. Okay. Didn't mean to do that. It was literally a force of habit. Deafens you, your uh, hard suits heads up display, interprets its info it into a series of zeros and ones. They repeat again, blanking on all frequency, blanketing all frequencies until the lights on the final D VI terminal flicker and die. Your specialization class will replace your your base class. Really on the squad uh, talent ranks. Okay, so go to your squad screen, view the bonuses you gain from each. Okay, this is new. Um, how do I, how do I view the bonuses? What? Do I? Huh? Negative contact. Okay, well that was the end of it, but how do I uh how do I do specialization classes then? Where's the Mago? Yes. Oh, wait, is there, um, let me see. So how do I do this? Okay, wait, you can only unlock this once per character, so how do I... Still, I still don't see. Oh, 
But where do I go to do it? So here's the guy, let's see. Or did they take that out? Huh. Let's go down to the medical lab and see. probably just never gonna figure it out <laughs> it, it's usually how that happens yes commander is there something you need she has I should nothing go. about it goodbye commander Yeah, this doesn't scroll down anymore. I don't have any new options. Huh, okay. Um, there's another. You know what, maybe we can talk to the crew. We'll see. like they have any other options really come on there we go well then I guess we're gonna do with um, another DLC I think I've heard it's the one that introduces the Batarians to the game and it's uh on an asteroid, that asteroid marker that we've been uh, seeing. Let's hit it. Um, again, don't know what I'm up against, so we'll take these two. trying to blow up a colony on an asteroid. What's, what's behind us? Oh, 
Okay, so there's no real time limit, so I guess we can explore all we like. Beaten. Oh my god. Huh. Turn, 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 turn. There we go. supposed to destroy or get rid of or disable the thrusters. Heading in the right done. direction. I don't know who you are, but I'm damn it. Here you go. Uh, there, there, there's the guns. Uh, where'd my reticle go? This is not gonna be good. Targeting it. Heavy resistance. Give no quarter. Okay, no cutscene. Uh oh, there we go. Batarians. Okay, that popped off. Upstairs. Wait, what did we kill? 
kill all of them? Okay, never mind. I'm reading that the torch is offline. Was that you? Can you hear me? Uh, yeah. I hear you. What's going on? Who are you? My name's Kate Bowman. I'm an engineer. I was part of the team assigned to bring this asteroid to Terra Nova. We were attacked yesterday by Batarian extremists. I've been hiding since they arrived. I think they know the torch went out. Uh, what do they want? Why are they doing this? I don't know, but if this asteroid isn't slowed, millions of people on Terra Nova are going to die. If I find out anything, I'll... I've gotta go. Good luck. Okay, they must be watching them. So there are what, like three or four of these? Why do they call them torches? They're clearly jets. Hey. <laughs> oh God. I didn't mean to. Are you hurt? Takes more than that one shot to bring me down. Sorry. I didn't even realize you were human until, well, I guess I'm not much of a soldier. I know you're scared, but I'm here to help. Commander Shepard, with the Alliance. Simon. Simon Atwell. I'm the chief engineer on this rock. Listen, we don't have much time. The Batarians fired up the fusion torches. You've got to shut them down before we hit Terra Nova. There are four million people down there, Shepard. I... my family. They live in Aronis. My kids and grandkids. Nice community. Good schools. Uh, how bad is it gonna be? I understand the situation. I don't have time to do the math in my head. What happens if we don't stop this rock? X-57 is 22 kilometers long, twice the size of the asteroid that wiped out the Earth's dinosaurs. Shit! It would be like millions of fusion bombs striking at once. Millions! Shit. The heat of the blast. A thousand kilometers away, clothes will ignite. There'll be global wildfires. Air shock will flatten everything for hundreds of kilometers. Terra Nova will die, Shepard. Not just our colony, the planet. There'll be a climate shift, mass extinctions. The ecosystem won't recover for thousands of years. Millions, maybe. What if we land in the water? Well, that's a dumb I That's still a dumb idea, because the same thing is going to happen. Is there any chance it'll land in the oceans? That would be even worse. Tsunamis would sweep inland at hundreds of kilometers per hour. Millions of tons of water would be vaporized at the point of impact. Global cloud coverage. The plants could all die, and if they go, the whole ecosystem rolls over. I'd have to run the numbers, but take my word for it. It'd be bad. All right, uh, why would they do this? I think that's all I need. <laughs> Alien bastards. No racism! This doesn't make any sense. Batarians run criminal gangs. Unethical, but profitable. They don't destroy worlds. What does this gain them? I've heard all the stories. Slave rings ranching people like animals. Pirate bands burning colonies to the ground. But this is... The Citadel Conventions forbid asteroid drops. I never thought the Batarians would go this far. Yeah, the Krogans used to do it all the time. Uh... They're not like this at all. Why wouldn't... Uh... Why wouldn't they? Most Batarians aren't genocidal madmen. But these ones are terrorists. Yeah, I know. It's just, this isn't how I expected the world to be when I rolled out of bed this morning. No, I feel you. I, I fully understand. You were on the ground when this happened. How many Batarians have you seen? And where? They landed at the main facility. It's locked down now. They've changed the passcodes. No idea what's going on inside. I did see groups head out to each of the torch stations. Couldn't say how many, though. Enough to give you a fight. Understood. Any idea who's behind this? Who's leading them? That might provide a clue. I heard a couple of them talking. They mentioned a Balak. It sounded like he's the one in charge. They didn't seem convinced this was a good idea, but they were scared of the guy. Scared enough to do what he wanted. I see. Batarians everywhere, and I need to shut down all three torches. Anything else I should know? One of the torches is surrounded by live blasting caps. We were set up to excavate when we arrived at Terra Nova. I rigged them with proximity detectors. That tank of yours will set them off, so you'll have to go in on foot. Even then, they'll explode if you get too close. Just go slow and easy. You should be fine. Okay, so you guys place mines? You set them up. Can you disable them? Not from here. No. 
There are manual controls by the entrance to the torch facility inside the blast zone. You can disarm the caps there. One last thing. I had a crew working off-site when the attack hit. I'm worried about them. These Batarians are ruthless. I saw them smash the faceplates of guys working vacuum. And those Varen. I don't think they always wait for a corpse before feeding. Understood. Uh, where would the crew be? Any idea where I can find them? They were running checks on our perimeter equipment. Easiest thing would be to tap into the transmission tower out on the surface. The equipment stations will show up on your sensors. Alright, I'll do what I can. I'll look for them, but the torches have to be my priority. Yeah, you're right. Saving Terra Nova is more important than my team. There were a bunch of engineers over at the main facility, but they're probably all dead. That are being held hostage by the Batarians. One of them got away. A woman named Kate Bowman contacted me. The Batarians haven't found her yet. Katie's alive. She's one of my best engineers. She signed on with her brother, Aaron, I, th I think his name is. He's part of the security detail. I hope they're okay. Okay, uh, evacuate Terra Nova, asteroid X-57. Give me a worst case scenario. We can't stop the asteroid. Could the colony be evacuated? Evac? Shepard, it took 30 years for the population to grow that large. I'm sure they're moving people to remote areas, but they'd never be able to get more than a few thousand off-world. We just don't have enough ships. No one does. Well, maybe the Quarians, but I don't see them suddenly showing up and offering us a ride. True. True. <laughs> Why were you moving this thing in the first place? Well, the idea was to drag it into Terra Nova's orbit, mine it out, and in the end you'd have a basic structure for an orbital station. It's a lot cheaper than getting everything up into orbit from the planet's surface. The minerals we extract almost cover the costs. That's actually a smart idea if you didn't have a bunch of genocidal maniacs trying to, you know, destroy the planet. What can you tell me about Kate? Smart as a whip and bold as they come. I hope she keeps hidden. If they find her... Oh, Katie. Don't do anything stupid. Alright, stay out of sight. Be safe. Well, you'd better find a good place to hide. If the Batarians come back and find you... Yeah. I think I'll make myself scarce. Good luck, Shepard. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Okay. I mean, I'd also recommend shooting anything that moves, because, you know, with me, it just bounced off my shields, and you had enough time to determine whether I was human or not. We'll see what this is and then we'll check them out. Again, there doesn't seem to be a time limit anywhere, so that's great. At least we know we can try to take our time. You know, within reason. Somebody tried their damnedest to hide away from people. I can hear you. Um, transition, transmission tower. Let's see if we can head to that first. Damn. Sorry. There's a lot of feedback. See if I can fix it. In the meantime, just keep doing. Sounds good. This is very close. This is very close. What the hell is that? Warning. Ground penetrating radar detects anti vehicle demolition nearby. Oh no. Proceed on.
shooting them does nothing. I'm on my way. Oh, oh no, oh god. Enemy sighted. I don't know how close I'm able to get to these fucking things. in the head. We're going to come at him from the high ground. Or on the high ground, I guess. Shutting down the torches. I won't ask you again. Find this problem and deal with it. Get her out of here! Ah, oh, shit. Okay. work our way through. I don't know if we have one or two more torches left, because they said three, but that could have not been including the one that we had already done.
Okay. Let's go there. Did we did we go here already? And that's a fusion torch. Main facility. Transmission tower. We hit the radio already, so I guess we can go to the tower and then to three. I guess we should have walked back and drove the Mako towards the door. Just, you know, it's always good to give Shepard a little exercise jogging about on an asteroid actively moving towards a planet. I think we did. Did I go in the opposite direction? Did I go in the wrong direction? Let's we'll see. Uh, journal. Okay, so they're just lost somewhere. We'll find them. So we'll find them uh, when we return in a moment, ladies and gentlemen, citizens of the Empire. So if you're on YouTube, please thank you so very much for watching. And please like, comment, subscribe on Twitch. Drop me a follow if you haven't already. And I'll be back in a moment. <laughs> 